How's it going, everybody? Bob here, playing a horror game called Gully Soda Pop. Well, that sounds like a very interesting title. Are we going to be going to a factory, maybe? Or maybe it's going to be one of those mascot horror Dá games. Pra que eu tenho que fazer. Could you explain more clearly Nosso what I need bem... to do? This job is kind of unusual. Cartazes do Gully. Gully old posters, huh? E o que tem de tão especial? What's so special about those posters? Why would anyone pay so much money for them? Urban legend? Okay. One last thing. What about the payment? Alright. I'll call you when I'm done. Gully, soda pop. Is that intro in Brazilian Portuguese? I can almost understand some of it. I heard tudo bem. All right, let's go. This game uses your mic. Be quiet. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna be loud as fuck because I'm recording my audio. But too bad, game. So I gotta try be quiet. Oh, that's brutal. Can I turn that down at least? Oh, I guess I can't. All right, well, I guess I'm just going to be permanently found this entire playthrough. All right, let's go. Time to explore the soda factory. And I need to what? Collect posters? I can grab wooden crates. Oh, it's got physics. Damn, son. I wasn't expecting that. Can I move this too? No. The doors have physics. Yes, they do. Very cool. Alright, so when this dick is chasing me, am I going to be able to escape? It's going to be kind of hard with my mic. I can see that it's already peaking. If I whisper, get away with it. Ah, whatever. Fuck it. We're going to have to figure this out the hard way. Alright, I guess we're just going in, Captain. Lockpick? Aw, oh, dude. Very cool. Skyrim. <laughs> Alright. Nice! I like those lockpicking mechanics. That is very sky. What the? Huh? You telling me this factory's not connected? What's going on here? Is this like the entrance hall? The factory's where the hell back here? Alright. What an immense thicket. Yeah, why? Oh, here we go. Go this way. I need to find the entrance to the factory. This place is huge! What the hell? Okay. thought that front thing was gonna be the factory. Nope. I gotta find it. What the hell is this? An owl? Cool. Very cool. Um. This looks kinda open. Nope. Dead end. Here we go. No, <laughs> never mind. Wheelchair parking. That's the wrong place in the wrong time. This way. All right, here we go. This looks big and open. Oh my. Oh, dude, I can already see the mascot. He was up there. So you're gonna come beat my ass? You know what? Fuck you, dude. I'm gonna be loud as shit. I don't even care. There better be a way I can like defend it. I can drag and stack these boxes to get through the broken window. True. Why not? Do some Half-Life 2 fucking physics puzzles. Okay, where am I putting this? Over here? Wait. Oh, yeah. Through? I need another box. Got to get, get over the box! You son of a bitch. Boop. Okay, give me another one. I need two. I need a two crates. How about now? There you go. Hey, come on, dude. Parkour time. Parkour time, you son of a bitch. There you go. Parkour. Parkour. Yeah, dude. Hardcore parkour. Michael. Parkour. Parkour. All right. It's very dark in here. Is this son of a bitch gonna be fucking chasing me because I'm making so much noise already? Is there hiding spots? Can I at least hide? Hello? What is this? Huh? A newspaper clipping. The Gazette! Menu is Monday, September 20... 1963? Oh. 
Local factory launches product with secret ingredient. The renowned soda factory announced today that it launched of a new line of beverages that promised to revolutionize the market with a secret ingredient dubbed Euphoria. Bro, you putting drugs in your pop? That's not cool. The soda is said to not only quench thirst, but also improve mood and boost energy of the consumer. Dude, are you putting fucking, like, cocaine in... Are you doing what Coca-Cola used to do? <laughs> the factory's director, Mr... Ar what is that name? Aristenio Machado. A pretty interesting name there. We're very excited about this new formula. We hope everyone can try it and feel the difference. Dude, that's not cool. You're giving everybody drugs without telling them the truth. Open. So, how am I supposed to escape this mascot, man? Huh? I haven't seen a single hiding spot. Open. What is this? Money? What the fuck do I need 10 cents for? Open. Empty gas can. Okay. Generator. I need to feel the generator to turn the lights on. These are empty. You tell me there's gonna be a full gas can somewhere? Okay, well that's brutal. True. These numbers seem important. 34. Maybe I should memorize them. 34! There's gonna be another half of a number somewhere? Oh, there's a vent to This place is complicated, dude. Alright. True. Pretty fucking intense. I wasn't expecting so much immersion in this little game. Alright, this is awesome. I need a gas can. <laughs> what am I doing in these vents? Oh, wait a minute. This is probably how you hide from dick face. Comes to try to get you, you just go in the vent. Right? Well, that's my guess. Um, there we go. Open. Did that just lead me in a circle? Yes, indeed it did. Alright, true. Water fountain. Not working. Okay, so you go invent to hide from beast? I guess? But where is he? He's in here somewhere. What is this? I don't know how to manage to forget your password so often, Raphael, but it's on the same board as always. Oh, the 34? This is 34. I gotta figure out the first, uh, first amount. Okay. Get out the way! Open sesame! I'm like slowly opening this place up, so where's the bad guy? Where is he? I don't know. Hello? What's this? Office. I know he's in here. Is that him? You coming to get me now? So far I need another code and a gas can. I prefer to find the gas can first because it's so fucking dark in here. What does this say? Diary page. The dreams are getting worse. I can hardly sleep without seeing those shattery figures. I'm beginning to think that euphoria has documented side effects. During an experiment yesterday, the animatronic mascot, which we used for marketing tests, seemed alive. I know it sounds crazy, but I swear I saw its eyes move. I need to review the calculations. There might be something more to this mineral? The director doesn't want to hear about the potential issues. Okay. Oh my god, there's a map. Damn it, it's in Portuguese! That's not gonna help me. You over here, mascot man? Bending machine's broken. The fuck? This place is huge! Locked. Huh. And here's something. I need gasoline. 
Give me the gasoline. Oh, gasoline? Brother, you in here, buddy? This James? guy stinks. What? Why is this lock so hard? There you go. The fuck was that? Open. <gasps> here we go. Give me. I found what I was looking for, Captain. Now can I find my way back? I don't know. Yeah, ladder? Okay. This place. Okay. <laughs> Finally! Alright. We got a bit of light now. Not much. Better than nothing, I guess. Now I need more code. More code. I only got 34. Where am I supposed to get the rest of that whiteboard? Like if half of it's on the ground here, shouldn't it be around here somewhere? Right? Where's this fucking monster? I know there's a mascot guard in this place somewhere. What's this now? Oh! I actually found one of the posters. I knew it. We are in Brazil. All right. I turn the jukebox on so the guy comes over here. What is this now? Another newspaper clipping. The Gazette. All right. Incidents at the soda factory. Worker attacks colleagues. A shocking incident occurred. On the product line at the soda factory last night, Joy De Silva, an employee with over 10 years of service, violently attacked his colleagues for no apparent reason. Joy was known for his dedication to work and for being a calm and friendly person. Witness reports that the attacker behaved was extremely erratic and out of control. Maria, a co-worker, described the scene. Joe had been acting strangely all day. He seemed distracted and confused. Suddenly... He started shouting and flailing his arms. Before we knew it, he attacked Antonia, our supervisor, with a wrench. Our employee in consumer safety is our top priority, stated the factory spokesperson. We are doing everything in our power to understand what happened and to ensure it does not happen again. Stop giving your workers drugs, you dumbass. What the fuck? <laughs> God damn it, he's right fucking there. That's the I made too much noise. No, he's gonna get me! Can I hide in that locker beside me? Well, I'm gonna have to be quiet as soon as I'm out of this reading. God damn. Report. Summary. Initial tests of the new soda formula are progressing well. The addition of the compound Euphoria has shown promise in small batches. There is a significant increase in energy and well-being among consumers. But a report vivid dreams. Well, then don't take it. The euphoria substance was isolated from a rare mineral found at an underground factory. Flavor tests are being adjusted to mask the metallic taste. Early animal tests show mixed results. Some aggressive behaviors were observed, especially in rodents. I recommend increasing the dosage in larger batches to test the commercial viability. This sounds terrible! Alright, let's try hide. Very, very quiet. Fuck you. I know you're there, you sack of shit. You're an asshole. Suck on my nuts, you son of a bitch. I need to find code for that key. What is this? Summary. The formula with euphoria was tested on a large scale. Alarming results. Consumer reported severe hallucinations, erratic behavior, and episodes of violence. Product has never been halted until further notice. Detail. Significant increase of reports of abnormal behavior. The animatronic mascot was found outside its charging base multiple times, despite no mechanical failures detected. Consumers who ingested euphoria 
experienced vivid dreams that turned into constant nightmares. A serious incident occurred on the production line, where a worker attacked his colleagues for no apparent reason. Suspend production of new formula. Conduct a thorough investigation into Euphoria. Consider deactivating the animatronic ma mascot. No shit! So we can ensure it not being affected by the compound. So this compound you got is making people have vivid dreams, then to nightmares, and is now making your mascot come to life? This sounds suspiciously like, I don't know, some kind of meteorite crash on the earth? It's some kind of alien compound? Alright, true. Where is this mascot? He's such a loud fucker. I saw him. He ran right past me when I turned the music on. Oh, hell no! There he is! Doc Sucker! Damn, he's fast! Fuck you, dude! Oh, as long as I'm running, I can get away. Okay, fuck you, dude. Can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man! Turn that music back on. Here. Fuck you, dude. I can't use it again? I need to find this fucking code. Hmm. I need whiteboard code. Where could it possibly be? I don't feel like scrolling through all these numbers. Is it in here? No. There's got to be a whiteboard, a piece of it with two numbers on it somewhere. Open. Alright. Where could you be? Whiteboard. I don't want to get chased by this dickhole again. He's right over here somewhere. Huh? Oh, I haven't been in here yet. Raphael forgot the valve in the locker room again. What? What valve? Oh. God damn it! Okay, so where's the rest of this code? That's what I need! Son of a bitch, dude. I never asked for this. What about this? Locked? Okay. I just can't seem to find this fucking code. It's what I need, and I can't find it anywhere. There's a poster up there. I clearly gotta go around this way. Fuck, man. Hey, I just need code. That's it. Hey. Got another one. Here we go! 79! Finally! Okay, now where the fuck is that locker room again? Surprise, motherfucker! No! Bastard! Okay, I'll go in here. You can't catch me, you fucking prick! Fuck you, dude! Did he just go into the ground? That was weird. Look at all the blood everywhere. Man, he mauled my ass. What an asshole. Hey, what was it? 79? Um. 70 something. I think it was 9, right? Open. 73? Now I gotta go back and check. The fucker chased me and made me forget. God damn, that guy's quick as fuck, dude. Hey, where's the office room? Office! There we go. Hey, what was it? It was 79. 7934, right? 79. 
Come on. 7934, open. Why aren't you opening? Huh? Do I have to touch it? No way, that makes no sense. Heart is missing. I know, who cares? I already got the code, 7934. Why isn't it working on the damn thing, huh? Eh? Three, four. Okay, now it should open. What the fuck, dude? Open sesame. Come on. I press enter? Space? What the hell is this? I got a driver's license. What are you talking about, game? What? Okay, whatever. I got what I was looking for. Let's go turn off that gas. Hopefully this bastard doesn't chase me and smack me up again. Fucking prick. Monster's kind of an asshole. Giant pickle man. Ah, oh, fuck you, pickle man. You can suck on my pickle. How about that? Hey, okay, a key? Is there a key in here? Damn well better be. Can I flip this? No. Oh wait, was that the locked door? Oh, maybe there was no key. And what's over here? Nothing. Alright, here we go. Gimme, open sesame. Grab wooden planks. But why? I already know where the last uh, poster is. Right outside this door over here. Right here. I got all the posters. Can I just leave? Whoa. Where is he? Um. Pickle Man's chasing me, I think. Oh. God damn it, you stupid pickle. Come on, dude. I'm trying to fucking move a plank. Be an asshole. Yeah, I just gotta put a plank. Oh, oh my no. pickle! <laughs> Fuck you, pickle. Come over here, dude. Come on. Chase me, pickle. Chase me! Lead you into the air again. Fuck you, pickle. Come on. I know you're gonna disappear into the ground. I know you can hear me. Fuck you, pickle. Yeah, dig into the ground. Fuck off. You stupid prick. If he's in that room again, I'm gonna be pissed. That means I gotta lead him in a giant circle just to move a board. A little bit of a pain in the ass, but it's okay. I got the layout of this place kind of memorized now. Hey, don't be in here. Pickle man, better not. Better fucked off. Thank you. Come on, Plank. You got this. No problem. Alright. You behind me again? Did I get away? Yeah, let's escape the pickle man! I got the posters, let's go! Fuck you! Run, dude! Run! It's locked! Oh, fuck me. No way, dude. Please tell me there's an escape. Why are you hiding behind boxes? What exactly are you doing here, bud? Um, you wanna run away? <laughs> fuck you, pickle! You'll never catch me alive, Pickle Man! What? Damn what it! The fuck? You got me! After all of that? Damn, that was a fucking awesome game. That was hard as shit. 
That was really, really good, though. Pedro Luz. Gator winner, Lucas Chagas. J.O. Victor Alves. Good job, guys. That was a great little game. Very immersive, too. Hey, thank you guys for making it. Very awesome. Very interesting. Very unique. We got another mascot horror, but this one's at least different. Not the same thing over and over again, which I'm quite happy about. That was very, very fun. That was very hard, too. I actually had to, like, get my bearings and memorize the layout of the whole factory. And that damn pickle beats your ass and leaves blood everywhere. <laughs> Pretty awesome! The only thing I'd say is I wish there was a happy ending. I put in all that effort to get those posters and I die?! Son of a bitch! Well, I always leave the games in the description. Hey, give this one a download, give it a play. Let's see if you guys can get through this the same that I did. It's pretty hard if you got a mic making noise pulls them towards you. Very, very fun. Go give them some love and some support. They definitely deserve it. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment and subscribe for more. Hey, I read and reply to every single comment, so shoot me one. Request a game, say what's up, say hey, anything you want to say. It really helps out with the forbidden YouTube algorithm. And of course, thanks for watching. As always, Bobby Wan here, and peace out. Of the dark, white tea legend leaves his mama in the realm of horror. She prevails, no fear, not the story of a veil. Yeah. Hateful bastard is in control. He must tremble as he takes his toll. So if he jumps down, he stands tall. Both the villains conquer all the mob. Oh, horrors, they are